this is me Vasanta Thapa. Uh, we are here to discuss uh, various problems regarding the math subjects and under that we are here to discuss sit operation. Uh, basically we have there are four fundamental sit operations <coughs> and they are union of sets, uh, intersection of sets, difference of sets and complement of sets. And we'll discuss all these four fundamental set operations uh, one by one. Here we go, uh, union of sets. And we assume that uh, you have already discussed various types of sets, subsets, and cardinality of sets in class six. And on that assumption, I'm starting my lesson. Uh, basically, this is for grade seven. And uh, union of sets, we are here to discuss about union of set at first. Uh, union of set basically means when we uh, take the elements of two or more sets in a combined form. Here you can see, when the elements of two or more sets are combined and listed together in a single set, it is called union of set. Here I have given the examples also. If A equals to 1, 2, 3, 4 and set B equals to 2, 4, 6, 8, the union of set A and B are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 8. I will make you more clear, giving one more example from the board. Please look at the board. If A equals to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, B equals to 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then A union is represented by this cop. We call it union. This is the symbol for union. A union B is equals to, in this A union B, we write all the elements of A and B, but we do not repeat the elements. We just write all the elements once. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This 3, 4, 5 has already been written here. So we do not write these elements again. So rest of elements 6 and 7 we write here. And this we call A union B. I think you are clear with this example. After some time, in the next session, we will discuss about the Venn diagram representations of these sets. For this time, this was only about the union of set. Next is the intersection of set. Intersection of set means when the common elements of two or more sets are listed in a separate form or if we take only the repeated elements in a separate form, it is called intersection. By the name intersection, we can have the common sense. Intersection means when the elements are repeated, that repeated elements only will take here. For example, in a set A, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In set A, we have 5 elements, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And in set B, we have 2, 4, 6, 8. You can see here the elements 2 and 4, 2 and 4 are repeated in both the sets. And we take only the repeated elements in a form. It is denoted by A, intersection. This is the symbol for intersection. And this is cap A cap B or A intersection B and that is 2, 4. 2 and 4 has only been repeated. So the symbol cap is used to denote intersection of sets. One more example I will provide you here. Please look at the board. Let's write the question. If A equals to a, B, C, D. B equals to C, D. Let's say you can write elements E, F. Then A intersection. I have already said this is the symbol for intersection. This is the cap form A intersection B. And in this A intersection B, we write only the repeated elements in set A and B. Here, if you notice, here A elements is 
they are repeated? This is not repeated. B, B is not also, B is also not repeated. And C, okay, C is repeated. What about D? D also has been repeated. And rest of all the remainders, they are not repeated. So E, sorry, C and D. This is the elements of A intersection. I think you got it. Next set operation is difference of set. We have discussed union of set. We have discussed just we have just discussed union of set. Second, we have discussed intersection of set. Now we are discussing about Difference of set. The difference of two sets A and B denote is denoted by A minus B, or it is also read as A difference B, is the set of all inlines contained by only A but not by B. Here I have the example, and I'll make you more clear, give you an example on the board also. Look at the board. For example, if A equals to A, B, C, D, B equals to B, X, Y, Z, you can write any elements. For example, we are just taking an example. Then A difference B, A difference B means the element contained by set A only. Look at here. B, it has been repeated in both the set. Don't write this. C, is, it, is this element contained in base set? No. D, D is also contained in set A only. So, here we write A minus B or A difference B means the elements that are present in set A only. So we write here A, C, D. A, C, D elements are repeated in, uh, is present in only set A. So this is called A difference B. Union of set, intersection of set, difference of set. And the last one is, and the last one is, Complement of set. Now the last set operation is the complement of set. The complement of set, it means if a set A is the subset of a universal set U, U means the universal set, then its complement is denoted by A dash. A, C or A bar. Complement of set is represented by, you can write A dash also, we can write A cap C also, we can write A bar also. This all means, these all symbols denotes complement of set. We can use any symbol to use the complement of sets. And complements of set means the difference with the union. Let me explain with an example. For example, if U equals to, U means the universal set. U contains uh, the elements of 1, 2, 3, da, 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 up to 10. And A equals to 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Then A complement, A complement means, A complement means difference of U minus A. You can take it as formula also. You can use this term while solving the problems in many places. So you can mark it as formula also. So A difference or A complement means the union, the, uh, the difference of union and A, write the elements of U, 1, 2, 3, up to 
routine. If the numbers are in a continuous series, you can write dot dot dot. 1, 2, 3, and then up to 10. And difference of 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. In the difference of set, in number 3, we have already discussed about the difference of sets. Here we use the same concept. This means the elements contained in only U set. The elements contained in only universal set. Now we write here. 1, 2 is two has been contained in set A. We didn't write uh, 2 now. 1, 2 is present in set A. So we didn't write here. 3, 4 is here. We write 5. 6 is here. We write 7. It is there. So we don't write 8. We write 9. So 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. These elements are contained in only U set. Rest of order, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. This is contained in set A. So we don't write these all elements. So we just discussed union of set, intersection of set, difference of sets, and complements of sets. Next, we have to represent all these set operations in Venn diagram. In this way, try out and if you have any queries, if you have any questions, uh, you can ask me. At the first also, uh, I have uh, given the front page. In that front page, you have my email ID. If you have any problems, uh, any queries, you can ask through my email ID also. Okay, thank you very much.